Just tell us about that race. Are you disappointed with second because you've had a few? Yeah, few yeah. Obviously, it would have been it would have been nice to win, and it was just just trying to weigh out the options on the last lap because I knew if I'd, I'd have gone for a long one, you went all out for the win, and then you you could get caught because there were obviously four Wiggins in the break, and then a couple of Bibi, Bibi and Moses. So um, if I'd have gone long, and then it, I'd have came back, and then I'd have wouldn't have really had the legs to sprint. So I just thought go for the sprint instead and limit my losses if anyone does come round me and obviously Bimmy attacked quite early on and held it which was a fair play and Ethan and Gabs came round me but then they faded a little and then I came past them so because I know it's, it's real real slog so um, but yeah obviously a couple of seconds down on Bibby and see how, we, see how we go tomorrow he was just hard in that it was tough in that move because obviously there were like four Wiggins guys there and it's, you're trying to keep the momentum there a little bit because I had Isaac Monday with me, which is good. Um, but, and then the last thing you're wanting is like attacks, and they're only being me and Isaac to cover four, four guys or whatever. So, yeah, it's a tough one to uh, try in a tactical way, sort of thing. It went, it went quite early. Yeah. And, yeah. and even the first time, I think there were a few riders dropped going out to, to, on that Blanchard circuit the other way. Yeah, yeah. That, that first time. Yeah. So it's quite grippy. I mean, there was a lot of still a lot of momentum in the break to, to get that gap. Yeah, um, I think six of us went just as we were about to start the climb and then quite a few came across on it. Uh, and then obviously there was, was there in the end of about 14 of us up and something. Um, but yeah, it was it was a pretty tough day. I, like always trying to just like, back off, but these roads and this course around this area, you're just on the pedals all day and the, the average power and the normalised power is pretty high. Yeah. A lot of people are talking about the Tour of Britain qualification. Mm. Does that add extra pressure to you guys when you come into a race, or is it just pressure anyway? No, yeah, you can. You could definitely tell that to the, uh, the start of today's race, it was just dead weird. Like no one really wanted to be aggressive. Yeah. Everyone's like watching one another, and you've got all the smaller teams attacking, and there were about eight of the smaller teams up the road at one one point. There were like no counter teams there, and then you get like one person attack, and then it's just weighing out who's in the move. If everyone's there, then everyone's happy behind. So it's just as, as long as everyone's got a jersey in that breakaway, then everyone's happy. So it's, it's definitely big, plays a big factor in these races. And how going, close it is together as well. And going round the course the other way, how did mm. that affect things? Um, the climb on the other end is pretty draggy and quite a, quite windy as well. Um, so I wouldn't say it's as steep as the other side, but it's a lot longer. Um, but yeah, it was all right, not too bad. Enjoyed it. And you've got your road legs back after all those crits? I'd say so. I've been, um, we went to Belgium and Holland after the Tour Series, so I had a good solid uh, race out there and then just been training and time trialling. So, but it's, I noticed the legs a little bit today because obviously in a race it's a lot more jumping, you can feel the legs, whereas training you can go out all day, feel real good, but it's just because you're like constant all day, whereas racing it's a lot different. But yeah, the legs are there, so yeah. Final word on next week, national championships. Where, where are your ambitions lie? Uh, gonna have a good hit out in the time trial. Hopefully, uh, see, see how I can go there. Uh, been having a bit, of, uh, bit of time on the time trial bike, and then uh, yeah, the road race. Uh, obviously, it's, it's a good course at the Beaumont Circuit, and I think it suits me a little bit. It's not too lumpy. It's, it's, it's a um, you've done well there before. Nutrition, yeah, I'd say on that sort of course. So, and it's not that long, is it? It's 184 k or so. This year's national, so could be a little bit longer, but never mind. Yeah, hopefully, yeah, it should go well for us and, and the team. Still a battle to go tomorrow, though. That's it. <laughs>